Hello, welcome back to my cave, and I'm going to be showing you how to animate for free on iOS and Android. Right, so first you want to click the plus button in the bottom right corner, then name your animation. Uh, I'm going to name it E, just because why not. Then choose your background, I'm going to choose this the paper background because it looks nice. I can't be bothered to make one. Then choose your frames per second. I normally use 20 or 24, but for the style you're doing, uh, you should probably choose uh, 15 or 16 frames per second. So that's what I'm going to choose. I'm going to choose 15 frames per second. And then exit out of it and click create project. Uh, now, um your circle uh i for this you should probably use the circle tool i don't use it but it's better if you do and uh, yeah uh, click the ruler in the top right corner uh click the circle just um just... circle around it and for the width of the pen i recommend using 0 0.70 that's just what i use though i just think it's the best uh for what i do then draw your body. Uh, I'm gonna make the body like go off the uh, screen, but um, yeah, here's a few attempts of me uh, failing to draw a body. Um, okay, just use the ruler tool. So click the ruler tool, uh, then click the straight line tool, and position it to where it's coming out like from the uh, hedge then just draw down from it uh, I'm trying not to make it too skinny or fat like I used to do Ooh. yeah then fill it in but don't make it look exactly the same just make it look like a hoodie maybe a beanie stuff like that yeah then create a new layer just like I did then draw the eyes and the mouth and the uh, um the arms, I don't know why I forget how I forgot that. Yeah, and then draw some the eyes by turning the width up. Uh, just like this. There we go. Yep, yeah, uh, also, uh, the dot eyes don't really look that good unless you've got like something covering up the top of your head because it looks like you've got a very big forehead. So I'm gonna uh, go back to layer one, turn, and I'm gonna turn down the width of the pen back to 0 0.70. Uh, then I'm going to draw some simple old hair. I would draw hair more uh, advanced, but like th this is not a how to draw tutorial, it's just a tutorial, I guess. So yeah, choose the colour and fill in the hair, or whatever you're colouring in to fill, in to, uh, fill out my steel hedge. Then go back to the sec second layer and draw the arms and mouth, just like I did. Or just like I am but okay that's your body now uh there we go um now click the audio button in the bottom in the bottom left corner just like um this and then click the plus button in the bottom right corner um click the audio button and this then record your audio by holding the uh, audio icon while you while you say stuff and then stop holding it when you're done and then click the tick and drag and drop it in then and then when you play it will play the audio so go to the part where it's where uh it's you start saying stuff and crop out the empty parts so the parts behind it then go to the front and crop out the empty parts in front of it and then hold it and drag it drag and drop it to the beginning now uh click on your frame and then click the copy button then the paste button so like the paper button then the uh, clipboard button and paste it until you think it's appropriate to for him to uh, change uh, the his eye where his eyes are or his mouth or his arms uh, also if you haven't already switch to your second layer with all the arms on and you can easily just rub out the face and it's 
it's a lot easier to do it. There we go. I'm going to open the mouth. I'm going to add a tongue and colour in the rest of it black. You don't have to. Uh, it doesn't have to be black. You can use the fill tool and make it like kind of dark red. But I'm going to make it uh, colour it the rest of it in black. Yeah. Then draw your arm like that. I'm going to draw it like so he moves that up. Like how he's explaining it. Then copy and paste it a bit more. Then when you think it's appropriate for him to move again in a different position, then make him move again in a different position. There we go. Looks like his eyes are closed. Yeah, now I'm going to draw, now I'm going to move his mouth a bit uh, like that. And then I'm going to um, draw one eyebrow because I just... Why not? And then I'm gonna move his hand to make it look like he's pointing, like how some people do when they talk, like that. Now copy and paste it until the last part of your frame. Uh, there we go, just like that. We're gonna put it to frame twenty because that's when the audio ends. And then, uh, boom. Now let's watch it over. This is a test. This is a test. This is a test. This is a test. And we, um, that only took six minutes to make. So, yeah, uh, I hope this worked for you. I hope you enjoyed the video. And subscribe. Uh, also, like the video. Bye.